at Harbor Front Center uh, and we're waiting to take a ferry over to Batam, Indonesia. The really cool thing about living in Singapore is that Indonesia is only like a 45 minute ferry ride away. And the weather is actually a bit rainy. It's been raining a lot in Singapore these days um, and hopefully it won't be so gloomy when we get there. So fingers crossed. So the terminal is just like an airport. I've never been on an international ferry ride before but they have like the security checking and the passport checking and they even have a duty-free store which I actually haven't expected but that's a kind of interesting. That's me on the car. checking in after lunch and it's a very rainy and cold day so their goals are pool and I don't really want to go out luckily this hotel is kind of connected to everything there are like a couple malls nearby so this is pretty much a staycation because you know we just came here to enjoy the Marriott for cheaper because in Singapore it's like super expensive. So we're gonna enjoy the hotel facilities, maybe not the pool but everything else and tomorrow we've got a spa package booked so it's going to be a nice and relaxing trip. Okay so we were in the hotel watching TV when we got a little gift from the hotel. dinner we're here at a seaside restaurant and it's really nicely lit up and still decorated for Chinese New Year um, and we ordered a bit of seafood to eat for dinner the very weird thing is that the menu here has no price at all and you have to ask the waiters to, to tell you what the price is which makes no sense I don't understand why they won't list the prices on the menu but uh, we asked and the price was reasonable so yeah that's what we're eating today Okay, so we just got back from dinner and none of the waiters there can speak any English, but Right. But he can speak Bahasa. <laughs> he can. He literally was my translator today. Anyway, we stopped by the supermarket and we got some Indonesian snacks. Should we try some?
it's been raining all morning so basically we had no opportunity to go to the pool we did check out the buffet breakfast though and it is a very 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 huge spread of foods and it's really affordable especially for a five-star hotel so breakfast was super yummy and we ate so much that we skipped lunch today and then since there was nothing else we could do um, we went to the gym and the gym is really nice and then for most of the afternoon we've been watching netflix currently watching the glory and now it's finally time for our spa appointment Okay, I got a little hungry, so we're gonna have a quick snack at KFC. And Nick wanted to try KFC here because supposedly KFC in Singapore really, really sucks. Mm -hmm. 